Hello friends and welcome back to Auto Care Secret, the channel where we make car care simple, fun, and stress-free. Today, we are diving into the 10 most important sensors in your car, what they do and the symptoms you lines notice when they start to fail. Trust me, by the end of this video, you'll be a sensor expert. Let's get started. 10 Key Car Sensors and Their Failing Symptoms Number 1. Mass Air Flow Sensor Moth First up, the Mass Air Flow Sensor, or MAF. This little guy measures the amount of air entering your engine so Pewter knows exactly how much fuel to mix in for the perfect combustion. Symptoms of a bad MAF sensor Rough idling or stalling Poor acceleration And decreased fuel efficiency the takeaway, if your car feels sluggish or your gas mileage drops, this sensor might be the culprit. Number 2. Oxygen Sensor O2 Next, we have the Oxygen Sensor. This sensor monitors the amount of oxygen in your exhaust to help your car as computer fine-tune the air-fuel mixture. Symptoms of a bad O2 sensor The check engine light comes on, poor fuel economy, and rough engine performance. The takeaway, if your car starts guzzling gas like it's thirsty, this sensor might need a checkup. Number 3. Throttle Position Sensor TPS Number 3 is the Throttle Position Sensor, or TPS. This sensor tells your car's computer how far the throttle is open, so it knows precisely how much power you're asking for. Symptoms of a bad TPS? Jerky acceleration, uneven idling, or sudden stalling. The takeaway, if your car feels like it has got a mind of its own and lunges forward or hesitates, this sensor could be on the fritz. Number 4. Coolant Temperature Sensor Alright, number 4 is the Coolant Temperature Sensor. This sensor keeps an eye on your engine's temperature to prevent that dreaded overheating. Symptoms of a bad sensor, an overheating engine, poor fuel economy, and the check engine light comes on. The takeaway, if your temperature gauge is acting weird, don't ignore it your engine could be at serious risk. Number 5. Crankshaft Position Sensor Moving on to the crankshaft position sensor. This sensor monitors the position and speed of the crankshaft, which is absolutely crucial for engine timing. Symptoms of a bad sensor Engine misfires or stalls Difficulty starting the car And poor acceleration the takeaway, if your car's acting like it doesn't want to start, this sensor might be the issue. Number 6. Camshaft Position Sensor Next up, the Camshaft Position Sensor. This sensor works with the crankshaft sensor to ensure your engine S-valves open and close at exactly the right time. Symptoms of a bad sensor, rough idling, a noticeable loss of power, and the check engine light comes on. The takeaway, if your car feels like it's struggling to breathe or accelerating slowly, this sensor could be the problem. Number 7. Manifold Absolute Pressure Sensor Map Number 7. The Manifold Absolute Pressure Sensor, or MAP. This sensor measures the pressure inside the intake manifold to help the engine adjust the air-fuel mixture. Symptoms of a bad MAP sensor, poor fuel economy, rough idling, and engine hesitation. The takeaway, if your car feels like it's gasping for air when you press the pedal, this sensor might need attention. Number 8. Knock Sensor Alright, number 8 is the knock sensor. This sensor listens for abnormal vibrations or knocking in the engine, which can cause serious damage if ignored. Symptoms of a bad knock sensor, engine knocking or pinging sounds, poor acceleration, and the check engine light comes on. The takeaway, if your engine sounds like it's trying to start a drum solo, get this sensor checked immediately. Number 9. Wheel Speed Sensor Number 9 is the Wheel Speed Sensor. This sensor monitors the speed of each wheel, which is crucial for systems like ABS Anti-Lock Braking System and Traction Control. Symptoms of a bad sensor ABS or Traction Control warning lights come on and you may experience uneven braking or speedometer issues. The takeaway, if your car's braking or stability control lights are illuminated, this sensor might be the reason. Number 10. Fuel Pressure Sensor Last but not least, the Fuel Pressure Sensor. 
This sensor monitors the pressure in your fuel system to ensure your engine gets the right amount of fuel at all times. Symptoms of a bad sensor. Difficulty starting the car, poor fuel economy, and engine misfires. The takeaway, if your car's acting like it's on a fuel strike, this sensor could be the issue. And there you have it, the 10 most important sensors in your car and the symptoms you lines notice when they start to fail. These little devices might be small, but they play a huge role in keeping your car running smoothly and efficiently. If this video helped you understand your car better, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe to Auto Care Secret for more tips and tricks just like this. Thanks for watching and remember, when it comes to car problems, you've got this. See you in the next video.